Hi, welcome to WebOnk's April tutorial. The first quarter of 2024 has gone really quick. I hope everyone is doing well. In my last video, I was talking about the different types of meta Facebook campaigns. As a digital strategist, I would always recommend using the right campaign type to achieve the specific goals and running a mix of campaign types to get the best results. In my today's video, I'm going to show you guys once we set up a campaign in Facebook account, how to review the performance and what would be the most valuable metrics for the marketers to look at. Okay, let's get started. Where to find the ad report in your Facebook ad account? Firstly, please go to facebook.com and log in with your username and password. Once the page got loaded, on the left-hand side, click as manager with this bar chart icon. If your login manage a list of different ads account, please make sure you select the right one that you want to review. When you hover over to the left-hand side, there are quite a few menu for you to select. Under the account overview, you can see a very quick report about your ads account. On the top corner, you can select the date range that you would like to review from the 1st of April to the 17th of April and update. There are two types of predefined report for you to review. The first one is the performance and clicks. So this is very useful. Basically, you get all the crucial information about the campaign cost, amount that you spend, your budget, and the reach and impressions, the cost per 1,000 impressions. Then a very quick one that is about the performance, which including the cost per result and how many people come to the website through this campaign for the conversions. What I usually check is the third menu, that is the ads reporting. Under the ads reporting, the good thing for this report is you can see some visible chart. We can choose the bar chart which you can see a comparison of your current running ads compared to the previous running ads. Then the trend chart shows us the best performing campaign. We get the most rage from the first one, that is Facebook display remarketing. And we get the most of the impressions from the same campaign as well. The table chart is always the one that I used which listed all the detailed information, the reach and impressions. The impressions means the number of times your eyes were showing on the screen. The reach, which tells you the number of users that saw your eyes at least once. Bear in mind, reach is different from the impressions, where the impressions may include multiple views of your eyes, by the same person. Here is the ad spent during 1st of April to 17th of April. If you want to know more information, you can go to the right-hand side and select more info like the age we targeted and the gender as well as the country. The report can be customized you pretty much can select any metrics that you want to know and pull into this table, table report. Once you select the metrics that you want to view, then you can export this through the data table or row data table, CSV file or images. At WebWonks, 
we usually use the different types of metrics to measure the success of different types of Facebook campaign. For example, like Facebook display campaign, we definitely want to check the impressions and reach and how many traffics has been driven from the Facebook to your website as a brand awareness focus. If we want to generate any um, lead generation type of campaign, we would like to configure that Facebook conversions with our Google Tag Manager, and we can get the leads from the website directly, like the form submission, the email link clicks, as well as the phone number link clicks. By understanding the key metrics, the audience demographics, and the campaign performance, we are able to identify what is working well and what is not. This allows you to optimize your campaign strategy for better results, leading to a more effective campaigns. It also helps in making informed decisions about budget allocation in order to maximize your return. If you are looking for an expert to assist your business growth on Meta Platform or having any further questions, please contact WebWonks, doctors for your Google data. All right, thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.